Hi. Yeah, yeah. I love you. And I love every delivery driver because they're the only reason I eat during this pandemic. Which is why I want to throw the biggest party the world has ever seen for a delivery driver like this man right here. Ladies and gentlemen, the NDL are back to YouTube. Thank you. Last year I threw a pizza delivery driver a huge party, but this year I want to go twice as big. I want to go fully undercover with a pizza delivery driver, deliver some pizzas with him, earn his trust, then take a picture of him and plaster it all over the outside of my house, then give him a massive surprise. But for me to do this, I had to partner up with a pizza place that were willing to let me surprise one of their drivers, which proved harder than I anticipated. We don't deliver it, we just, uh, just collect. There's no delivery here. I want us to work together. Hi, we're here with the BBC. We want to team up with the pizza place. <laughs> this isn't a joke. I feel like you're all, you're all seeing me as a like one big joke. No, no, no. What I am the BBC. They all laughed at me. Everything was hopeless. No one seemed interested until we found Nono's Pizza. Hello, my friend. How are you doing? I am Mr. Somalana, aka Ringside, aka the leader of the NDL, the most famous organisation in the world. What's your name? My name is Lucy. After filling him in and showing him the money I was offering to his delivery driver, here's what he had to say. I'm happy to do anything for that. Well, let's sit down and we can talk facts. Sure. So I'm going to need you to write down um, some information for me. I need your best delivery driver. I don't want second best, third best. I need your best one. Mr. Payman? Mr. Payman. Well, I'll be paying man. Payman, yeah, Payman. <laughs> yeah, payment. I like that. What days does he work? So he's here from Thursdays to Tuesdays. Got it. Okay, very interesting. And, and how old is he? He's mid 40. Does he have Facebook? Does he have any social medias? Of course he has. Yeah. Now, as much as Essie was assuring me of Payman's character, I needed to find out for myself that he wasn't a murderer. So I decided to pay for an Airbnb in the area and order a pizza on one of the days that Essie told me Payman was working. So we're here at the Airbnb. I don't know what this guy's like. So we basically are just doing a, a background check. Hello? Hello, my inside man. Is Payman working today? Yes, he, will, he is working today. But if I make a delivery on Nono's right now, he'll be the one who delivers. He will be the one who delivers the order. Thank you, Essie. Let's get this show on the road. Here we go. The food is on its way. £23.50 on the food. Order confirmed. Okay, it's time. Let's get it ready. Let's get the camera set up. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Stop the video, guys. I just want to say like the video right now. We're back on YouTube. Please surprise me with the amount of likes if you've missed me. The screen's now gone black. If you still haven't liked the video, look at yourself in shame right now. Anyways, back to the video. <laughs> okay. To make sure we capture everything, we've got one hidden camera over there, another hidden camera just right here, and another one right over there. Hello. <laughs> Payment, you're going to get caught from every single angle. Let's do this. Now, obviously, I'm not going to be answering the door like this. I've got something a little more different up my sleeve. This is today's disguise. Look at me. I'm unrecognisable. This dodgy looking guy right here is Stevie Smith. He's a complete misogynist, a casual racist with some violent tendencies. And his aim is to see if Payman's a good person. Then the food arrived along with big man Payman. Hello. Hello. Hey, what's this? Is this the order, yeah? The 23.50. 23.50. All right, Jerry, let's get the cash. Get the cash. How's it going? Yeah, it's all good. Just waiting on my wife to get the money. Oh, I hate my wife. You, you got a wife? Yeah. You alright, huh? Yeah. Alright, hurry up, get the money! Sometimes I want to kill her. Yeah, take it easy, note. Well, you never want to kill your wife? <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes, all the time, I want to kill mine. <laughs> so, what, are you a murderer then, or? You know, there are regular places, eh? all of them, they ask it. Where are you, where have you been, where do you want to Yeah, and, and I just say, die. <laughs> yeah, that's what I say. Yeah. I'm, I'm this close, I hurry up to get the money! Or I'll punch you in the face! You have to punch your wife? <laughs> Sometimes you want to kill her? Yeah. But you're not a criminal? Yeah. You are a criminal? No. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. Do you, do you like kids? Oh my god, yes. So, so far he's agreed to being a killer and now he's a novice. I fear that this is not the driver for us. This couldn't be going worse even if I wanted it to. Okay, so are you what, a novice or something? I love both of them. <laughs> what, what, kids? So you just love your kids then, not, you're not an actual nonce? No. Oh, okay, that's good. That's good news. What are you waiting for? I'm waiting for you, because that's it. Oh, why didn't you go? I would have given you the money from the yeah, start. There you, you go. So All right, that's good. Yeah, thank you 
Take care of your son. Bye. Wait, mate, mate. What's your name? I'm gonna give you five stars. Hey, mate. Okay, got you. Interesting character. Right. Well, I guess you could say he passed the test. Well done, Payment. Worried me for a second, though. Although Payment didn't pass with flying colours, I feel there may have been a bit of a language barrier there. So we'll give him a pass, and by pass, I mean completely stalk him on social media and do the most thorough background check the world has ever seen. Now, it's difficult to find him, as Payment seems to be quite a common name. But then I got Essie to add me on Facebook, and would you look at that? We found him. And this proved he wasn't a criminal. I mean, look at him, he lives in Reading. That's a book. But it was time for me to meet Payment properly in person, as myself. But it's vital he didn't know who I was, so I bought an untraceable phone. Just cut yourself. Yeah. So I could make a phone call to the manager, Essie, about our next step, without Payment finding out, even if he had an army of hackers. Hello. Listen, Essie, I need us to meet in the woods. Don't ask too many questions, we don't know who's listening. Tell me a location and we can go there tomorrow morning. All right, Essie, tell no one about this call. Okay, we're here. Essie's dropped me his location. I think that's him over there. How you doing? Nice to see you. One thing I need to clarify with you is, is this payment? This is payment. How did you find that? It's best you don't ask questions, Essie. <laughs> okay. What I need from you is to come and work for you. All right, sure. Could you maybe tell him that someone from the BBC is coming in to work, work under, under him? I already give him some notice, you know, about it. So maybe someone come to make some programs. Okay, thank you, Essie. See you later. We've got to go that way as well, to be honest. <laughs> With a shift on the cards for tomorrow, a quick COVID test had to be done to make sure I didn't infect the whole place up. <laughs> and would you look at that? Our test came back negative. No Rona for us, man. Today's the day we're going in as a real employee. We got the go ahead with the test and I just feel like we've come a long way because he started off as a fake employee and now we're going in as a real one. And that's what you call progress. I can't wait. Hey, how you guys doing? Essie, nice to finally meet you in person, man. Driver. Payman? Yes. Nice name, I like that name. Never heard a name like that before. Only Payman covering in the morning. So pay Payman's the main man? Yeah, Payman is the main man. Good. <laughs> you have no idea. <laughs> Damn right he had no idea. And my guy S, he showed me the ropes of this magnificent pizza place and showed me how things work. I got myself comfortable with the man I would be spending my day with. And before I knew it, I was on the roads learning about the delivery driver, Payman. You know why I'm doing delivery? Why? Because I'm going to improve my language. I have two I can show you. You could teach me Iranian. Why not? To so say I wanted to say I'm scared. What would that mean in? Mitarsan. Uh, Mitarsan. All right. First delivery. Here we go. So you hold that and I'll hold this. Hello. You are sir. And your drinks as well. Mitarsan. Give it to Hi. Hi. Cheers, man. I don't think he likes me. No, no. Mitarsan. Mitarsan. <laughs> Have a lovely day. Meet her son. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Ah, no! Oh, crap! <laughs> let me get it, let me get it. So, how did I do? You scared? He was aggressive. Yeah, it was good. I, I loved it, man. I really was fascinated by the whole intimacy of it. Word must have got around about the great employee that was on the shifts at Nono's because more orders came flying in. Ah! You tried to scratch me. Ah! Oh, payment! Payment, payment, payment! I survived. I'm telling you, payment, this is scary stuff. The day was great and I managed to get payment's trust because he liked me as a person, which helped me get my picture of payment, which I was going to be using for the surprise. And as I grabbed that, more orders came through. Hi, I've got three pieces. Oh. Wait. Payman! She's shouting at me. She's shouting. She's screaming. Oh, oh, he started growling at me. Really? Yeah. After much success, I noticed that Payman had been a little quiet while waiting around, and I could tell he had something on his mind. I did a uh, delivery for one customer, and he paid. I came back to my car, and suddenly I saw another guy with the camera. The guy with the camera? Clearly wasn't good at his job. Yeah. They tried to took a video, and they. Got it. Small. The guy was tall man, sunglasses. There is no any hair. 
No, uh, he was bald. Yeah. What car was it? Uh, I think it's this Fuchs Wago. Yeah. Well, thank you, Payman. We'll go now. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, thank you, you so much. Thank, thank you. Thank you. So Payman saw George while he was filming, and I'm telling you now, George never told me. You are a shambles. You're hiding secrets from me, and this is all your fault. Good. I'm glad. Why? Well, just tell me why you didn't tell me. No, I don't know, man. I just don't care. Shambles, guy. Oh. Bye. Let's go, George. Let's go, George. Let's go, George. Let's go, George. He saw you. He saw you, and he brings it up to me. Black Volkswagen. Black Volkswagen. Cut before he sees. Oh my gosh, so everything has been foiled. We've got to round things up now. It's time to get the surprise out of the way. He's on to us. So to round things up, this is what we needed to do. This had to be the biggest party ever, so I got a whole production team to create giant posters of payment to put on the house. As Essie, his manager, agreed to this entire thing, I wanted him to be there for payment's big surprise. And finally, every big party needs a special guest, so I got the completely real legit Kim Jong-un to come down from North Korea to hand payment his brand new check. £4,000, it's a big day for him, and with that, it was time for payment's big surprise. Okay, today is the day we're going to be surprising my best friend, Payment. And we're going to be taking this one little picture right here and spreading it across this entire house. Now our good friend Essie has just arrived for the big surprise. What are you thinking? What have you done? <laughs> well that's Payman right there. Uh, he works oh at your God. shop. But that's also Payman right over there as well. Oh my God. Right now we might as well order the pizza, show the rest of the streets and wait for Payman to arrive. Streets! Streets! Calm down! This is the, the guy we're going to be surprising today. We've got a party for. Oh my... That picture right there. We've got one more person who's going to be part of this surprise party as well. Kim Jong-un, Supreme Leader. Oh, <laughs> Kim Jong-un! <laughs> nice to meet you, brother. So, let's all hide and uh, let's get ready to surprise payment and have the biggest party of all time. How long till he gets here? Yeah, he's about to get it right now. Everyone hide now. So the gates had been opened. Essie was camouflaged into his car and the streets were parked up. But then payment arrived. Look at the confusion on his face. Thumbs up to the camera's payment. This is your moment. Surprise! Surprise, payment! Let's go! Payment! <laughs> so here we are, Payman. I was thinking about you today, really. <laughs> you, how are you thinking about me? Yeah, would you like a drink or a cupcake or anything? Uh, thank you so much. What goes through your head when you come to the house and you see hundreds of pictures of me? I can't. I saw my pictures. <laughs> oh my God, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, Payman, there's a couple of things uh, which I want to talk to you about. Right here, this is a picture of me and Essie. Uh, this is when we decided that we were going to prank you. So then I tracked down your Facebook. Turkey. Don't worry, I know all of this already. And then the other day I wore a mask and ordered a pizza from you just so I could size you up in person. Oh my god. So this, so this was your plan as well? This was all part of the plan. Is that's me under the mask. Really? Yeah, that's me. It's quite different. Yeah, 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 I'm still, I'm still tall. But Payment, there's one more surprise for you. We appreciate all the work which you've been doing. So um, Kim Jong-un, Supreme Leader of North Korea, will hand you this again. Thank you, Payman. Payman! I know that money's all right, but I've got something even better for you. It's an NDL hoodie. Wow. wow. That's got the impression. Even Kim Jong Un's gone crazy. Yeah, he's impressed. Buy your hoodie, shop and the NDL. There we go. Buy it. Put it on. Let's put it on, Payman. Oh, now you're looking 30 years younger. So the only thing left now is, uh, is you got food? Did you bring the, the where's, where's the food? There we go, let's go, let's go. I love making videos like this where we can reward someone that's been working hard and supporting the people during these tough times while also having a good time with my friends, good vibes, good food, and good animals. Let's go!
So I walked him to his car and Payman was finally checking out. I guess you could say, Payman had been paid, man. And as for me, I guess you could say the NDL is back to YouTube. World domination is coming. Like the video, subscribe to join the NDL. Goodbye.